Welcome to the J. Sterling Morton High School District Naviance Tutorial Series. This is the continuation, part two, of the fourth video tutorial in the series. In this tutorial, we will demonstrate how to add courses by list and add alternates. Why are we adding alternates? If you were to be given an additional class, we want to know what those classes would be. If your first elective choice was full, we want to know what your second and third choice would be. In this continuation and in the past in the previous tutorial, we added the remaining courses in our ninth grade plan. We are now going to add the alternate courses to our ninth grade plan. Each and every student for 10th grade, 11th grade, and 12th grade should add three credits of alternates to their plan. Once you click on Add Courses Within Alternates, you are going to be asked to add three credits per year to your plan. As a freshman, we are going to add three alternates to our plan. I'm going to click plus next to the word list. In the first tutorial, part one of this series, we added courses based upon grade level. This example, we will add courses based upon a list. Clicking the plus here allows us to filter our list by subject area, course type, and grade level. Since we are entering grade nine, we are going to select our ninth grade courses. As a ninth grader, I'm interested in Computer Information Services. So I'm going to filter by CIS. And I notice that I have three elective options. If I were interested in TSI, I would select both the Semester 1 and Semester 2 TSI course. If I were interested in AP Computer Science, I would select the Semester 1 in semester two course. But for my third option, if I were not interested in computer information services and instead I were interested in a foreign language, I would navigate and filter by foreign language, still remaining in grade nine, and choose a foreign language alternate. After choosing my semester one and semester two course, I would move to add these courses to my plan. You have now successfully added three credits of alternates to your ninth grade plan. TSI is my first option. AP Computer Science is my second option. And Chinese is my third option. I can head back to my plan. As a ninth grade student, I now have successfully added all courses to my ninth grade plan. As a student, one thing to ensure that you've done everything correctly is to look for red flags on your screen. If you don't see any red flags, you don't have any errors. If you see a green check mark, that means you have met the graduation requirement for courses in that area.